Thank you, Madam Chair, and, and thank you to my colleague, Mr. Babin, sitting next to me uh, for offering this amendment. I've been a big proponent of Buy America and appreciate the provisions within the underlying bill that prohibit transit agencies from doing business with Chinese state-owned entities. But unfortunately, that provision comes up short because, as Mr. Babin said, it allows existing contracts to continue. Contracts that we just can walk outside of this building and, and see that violate what was once uh, what was once a, a bipartisan provision to ensure that China didn't undercut America and America's supply chains. Okay. This amendment corrects the shortcomings, as he said, by making sure that all transit agencies are treated the same for purposes of applying for dollars that are authorized in this legislation. We shouldn't be in the business of picking and choosing which agencies can bypass restrictions and which ones can. But I wanna be very clear, and I'm gonna say this very slow that, so that my colleague from Tennessee, Mr. Burchett, can understand it. Make no mistake, a vote against this amendment is a vote to protect China. I urge my colleagues to support this amendment and I yield back the balance of my time. 